choose one. What do I do? Do I read it? Or? Yeah, you read it. You can read it. Look at that. Oh, what are your goals for this season? Um, I mean, I just answer just generally. Uh, um, to be honest, uh, we're moving to Philadelphia. Um, everything's been such a blur this season so far that I haven't even thought much about it. However, I'd say now uh, a top 10 finish in Worlds would be uh, my goal for the rest of the season. <laughs> okay. So you have one to some other? Very nice <laughs> Yes, yes I have. Have you ever felt that the judges have not given you the score you deserve? <laughs> Yes, and I think pretty much at some point every ice dancer uh, has been in that situation. Probably. Yeah, it's always <laughs> like that, you know. So definitely, I can't, I can't remember when, when exactly, but definitely I have held that. <laughs> what is the weirdest thing a fan has done for you? I was in China. And everywhere I went, a Chinese lady um, kept shouting, Lloyd, smile, baby, and taking photos of me, and running after me, and giving me scarves and giving me presents, which was nice of her, but it was quite strange to have someone shouting, Lloyd, smile, baby, everywhere I went. That's a strange one for me. I'm not winning. Oh, yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> The Chinese one was scary though, oh, so that <laughs> made it more weird that I actually feared for my life a little bit in the same oh. time. <laughs> what do you dislike about the current scoring system? Um, a lot really. Um, I dislike the short dance, I don't think it's very good. That's my main criticism. Um, I'm trying to, trying to think. Um, yeah, I mean, my dislike is in the short dance, as seen in this competition. Um, for me, it highlighted there's a problem in the scoring system to have the, the best couple with a technical mark very low when they've done a clean skate and things like that. I mean, yeah. I, um, yeah, there's uh, some of the way the, the calls are given and things like that for the levels and things, there's often. It's often unfairly called for not just me, for all couples, a strange thing that happens. So, yeah, I'd say. And you see the protocols, it's like. Yeah, sometimes a, a perfect example is um, Javier Fernandez's quad in his, uh, in his short program. Oh, minus. It was beautiful, yeah, minus one. Yeah, yeah. he told us. How, like how would you explain that? Yeah. <laughs> there you go, there's a huge problem in the scoring system. You have two more. Two more. Have you ever called your coach and lied saying you could not go to training because you were sick? No, I've never done that ever. Really? Ever, yeah. That's a. Uh, in fact, I've. In the past four years, I've only missed about one day, I think, for being ill and not going to really? Yeah, really? Uh, yeah, genuinely ill. But yeah. Yeah, I know a lot of people do do that, but yeah, it's not me. <laughs> Have you ever forgotten a part of your choreography and had to invent? Yes, when I was hung over doing a show and uh, my head hurt and I was on the ice and for a moment I stood there and I, I just thought, what do I do now? And my partner just sort of looked at me as, and we had this moment where we just smiled at each other and then it came back. So for a moment the program stopped and then carried on. So it wasn't too bad, but yeah, not a nice, not a nice situation to be in. Yes. Thank you. Okay, so this is... Yeah. <laughs> two, two, two. This is... What? The other. 18. 18 points. Oh, okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs>